And here we have uh, some hurricane roof damage. And what we've done is we've installed a, a new ridge line in here, new half row. And prior to spraying the hurricane coating, we're going to seal all the little areas that you see. See these gaps under this tile where wind can pick it up? We're going to seal all this. Uh, first of all, you can see we've put roof tile adhesive uh, under each tile, and then we're going to uh, put uh, mortar in there and seal it over the roof tile and then we're going to apply a hurricane roof coating on top of that so this uh, ridge line will be uh, very very sturdy hello uh, uh, Chris from Southern Exterior um, today we're going to uh, spray a hurricane coating on this uh, uh, tile roof. The coating has a, uh, a wind upload force. It's been tested uh, for 130 mile an hour. Um, it's uh, a product which uh, binds, uh, it actually fills into the cracks of the tile, um, fills all the voids, makes the tile stronger, uh, binds each tile together like super glue and not only that it uh, it lasts for five years um, before it starts breaking down it's very strong product it kills all mold and mildew uh, no mold and mildew can grow on it and um, it has uh, a lot of uh, a lot of reviews and statistics and testing so it's a product that works so to you homeowners that are in the south florida area uh, do consider this because it's really the best protection uh, on these tile roofs. Um, inspecting this roof, the tiles haven't even been la nailed down. They're just laid on uh, the, the mortar. So uh, if wind was to get up and under this roof, it would be, you know, compromised very easily. Um, this is going to stop it and uh, let's just show you how we spray this product on. So uh, as you can see, it's a, it's a milky white color and dries clear, um, and uh, it absorbs in some areas very quickly and uh, and others uh, not so. Um, uh, I've seen this product work in uh, Hurricanes Wilma, Jean, um, and there are many uh, test results how it fared in Katrina. Um, very unique product. Uh, we are your um, uh, distributor applicator for the South Florida area so do give us a call today 561 502 roof Not from the roofing structure, no. no, drips, no, runs, no, no. Airs. 
this is after the test is over. We're trying to manually pick one up. This is after the 110 mile an hour test. And as you will see, it's rather difficult. But overall, the whole roof was a 100% success. This means you can take a 60 mile an hour rated shingle and move it to 110 miles an hour with basically doubling its resistant quality under Miami Dade testing. And uh, here we are today spraying a, um, a very high quality acrylic latex uh, on this roof that's just had the hurricane coating. We've also blended the hurricane coating with the acrylic latex. And how we spray it on is we want to get it in up and under the butts and in these joints. So we have great attention to detail on how we do this. We'll just show you. So uh, there you can see a, a very thick coat, probably a little thick. And then what we do is we actually come back sideways because we're spraying on that angle and we hit the other side of the tile. So there you have it. Um, very high quality coating. After this uh, first coat is dry, uh, we're going to come along and, and put another coat on it as well. Apply it the same way and what you're going to have is a roof that's uh, uh, got a, uh, a warranty on mold and mildew. Um, it's been wind tunnel tested with our hurricane product and not only that, we've uh, added the hurricane product into the paint. Okay, here we are on the uh, the front side of the roof, and um, we're going to put another coat on here. Um, again, we're going to angle it into the joints, so we've just got uh, more product there, and um, should be good. We've already coated that roof over there uh, uh, twice with hurricane sealer and twice with paint. Um, so we're putting the maximum amount of product you could possibly put on a roof like this, uh, great job.